morning. It is Saturday, July 9th. I just randomly decided that I want to do a little Atlanta weekend in my life. So that's what I'm going to do today or this weekend, I guess. We just got back from the beach. We were in Cocoa Beach and had such a great time. We have a couple fun things planned this weekend, so I just thought I would take you along. I just had my breakfast. Um, I've been doing some wedding planning stuff today, like working on my wedding website, our wedding website, and looking at like goodies. I don't know, like koozies and cocktail napkins and stuff like that. And now I'm gonna head to the gym because since we've been on the beach, um, I've just been laying for a week straight. So gonna move my body. Jim OOTD, this sports bra top is Lululemon, and so are the biker shorts, the six inch, I believe. Um, I've been wanting to be on the biker short trend for so long, but I was like, I have thicker legs, like I can't do that. And then one day I realized I don't care. I can do whatever I want and they're comfortable. And then Hoka Classics. <sighs> this is gonna be a rough one. Let's do it. just got back from my workout it's very good very hot in there the ac is broken in our gym so it's a million degrees um but i wanted to show you the new yeti we were at the beach we went to the largest ron john i'm pretty sure in the united states the world i don't know but they had these yetis with a with a handle and leak proof not a magnetic lid, it's a slide. It just changed the game because I've been wanting Stanley Cup really bad, but they're always sold out and I can't find them anywhere. Like I know they sell, sell them in Target, but I can never find them. But they have a Yeti with a handle and it's only 20 ounces, not 40 like Stanley, but that's fine with me. And I'm obsessed. Having handle is such a game changer. And yeah, that's my haul. Now I need to get showered, get dressed, for the day and then we're going to head out. We're actually going to the Atlanta Motor Speedway to do like, to watch a NASCAR thing. I've never been, but I'm excited to go. My parents' business is sponsoring a car that is racing. So it should be fun. Unfortunately, it's raining. So hopefully that stops. So we're not standing out there in the rain, but Robbie and Christine are coming with us. So gonna be fun. Sadly, Pesto can't come, but we love him. Yay! Oh yeah, my baby. All freshly showered, starting to do my makeup. I haven't worn makeup in so long, and I have been in the sun, so like my skin's all freckly, so I don't know how to act. Something that I've been into recently is Liquid Death. I was seeing it everywhere. Cody Co. like always has one, so I was like, okay, I want to try them because I've been loving AHA sparkling water. And then I saw Liquid Death has flavored berry. So now I'm obsessed. Obsessed. Fixating on Liquid Death. Now, having a quick little lunch before we go to the Atlanta Motor, Atlanta Motor Speedway. Because I'm not sure what kind of food they're going to have there. So just making a quick little rice bowl. Now what? I've never been to Atlanta Motor Speedway or any kind of like NASCAR racing type event. And I have no idea what to wear. So, this is about to be an adventure. Like literally what do I wear? No idea. Okay, so this is what I'm going with for the outfit. My parents brand is orange, so I'm wearing orange with this like really old black bralette under it. My Goldie Parker 
long shorts, and then some pumas. Weather is brightening up, so looking good. But, oh, and then a black clip because the colors are orange and black. I'm excited. And a rain jacket, of course, just in case. So cute. So we just got back from dinner. We obviously went to the race and then we went and got dinner. The race was really fun. It was really hot. Unfortunately, our guy, he, <laughs> our guy, he, his car broke down. So that was sad, but it was still a fun time. Came back home, stopped, let pesto out, fed him dinner, and then went to Storico for dinner, and it's so delicious. And, mwah. and now it is bedtime. For me, at least. Good morning, it is Sunday morning. I just had a cup of coffee, slept in a little late today. Um, that's good. We were up late last night, so it's good to get some sleep. I'm just gonna chill here, relax, until Riley gets up and make some breakfast and see what the day takes us. There's a few things that we might do, so I like me to go to Target, need to go to Trader Joe's, and maybe going to Verizon today to get new phones. So that's exciting. I've been on my 12 mini for like two years almost. And it's in perfect shape. I just thought it'd be a good time to upgrade since we're due for an upgrade. So we'll see.
this morning I'm just doing a quick breakfast. And when I have my quick breakfast, normally what I do is too good uh, Greek yogurt. It's really good because it's not too sweet. And then some eggs by the best eggs in the land. And then in the granola, or sorry, <laughs> in the yogurt, this is the best granola on the market. I'm telling you right now. I can never find it at Publix when I go myself. If I Instacart it, sometimes they can find it. A lot of times it's out of stock, but it's the Sola granola and it's gluten-free. So I think something about it being gluten-free, like it has these little rice crisps. I don't know, something about it being gluten-free, like I think is what makes it so good. It's so crunchy and there's like slivers of almond. It's so good. Okay, just got dressed, had my breakfast, fed pesto, everything. Um, and we are about to go to the Verizon store to try to get upgrades. Um, so that's what I'm wearing today, just Abercrombie tank. Same shorts from yesterday from a Goldie. I'm obsessed with them. Have a little like slit here. Um, and then these shoes, these are, I got them from Free People, but the brand is Golo. I'm not sure, but yeah, gonna be fun. Necklace is Amazon and this was a gift. I'm ready to go get a new phone. I'm hoping that they have 13 Pro Max in silver because that's the color I want in white. They don't have white for 13 Pro Max. So I'm hoping they have silver with like max storage. I'm gonna go see what that cost is. So hopefully it's not too bad. Well, same thing. Yeah, I guess it doesn't matter if I'm trading it in. Yeah. Will fine. I be able to transfer something else just because I know I'll put a fingerprint on it. That'll be <laughs> Okay. Can you tell the difference? 13 Pro Max. It's huge. That just took two hours. But we did it. Oh. have my new case on matches my nails so now we need to run to target pick up a couple of like cleaning supplies a couple food items and then we'll see what we do from there but i'm glad we got that over with we have been like wanting to switch our phones for so long now that i'm glad we just went ahead and did it dropped a pretty penny but Nowhere ever has my granola. It's so sad. <laughs> New phone cases on. So cute. I just put away some of the things we got from Target. Just like yogurt, smart food, and then some cleaning supplies like pine salt, um, dishwasher pods, laundry detergent pods, deodorant. Make up more wipes, stuff like that. And now I'm trying to pair an Apple Watch up with my new phone. Um, so waiting on that to happen, I'm gonna sit down, relax, have a Celsius um, before I go to the gym. I have someone staring at me. Hey you. Best Celsius flavor. Non-carbonated peach mango green tea. Highly recommend. People feel it, I feel like people don't know that there's non-carbonated Celsius, so if you don't know that, jump on the train, the best. Let's see. Yeah. Cheers. They're good. Oh. Chef's kiss. Okay, I think me and Pesto are gonna go for a walk. Um, he said, what'd you say? But here's the look. This top from Cream Yoga. I'm obsessed with Cream Yoga. They, I have a couple of tops from them now, but they're, it's literally so comfortable. The best material and super cute. Um, and then the high rise Lulu shorts. And then my hookahs. Things I pack in my 
belt bag to go for a walk. I have to have the bowl strapped up, of course. My cards, just in case something happens, I have my insurance card, my ID, and a credit card. Who knows what's gonna happen, just in case. Obviously, apartment key, a birdie, just in case anyone tries to mess with me. Close your ears. <laughs> so it flashes and it makes the loudest noise ever. <laughs> what was that, Bubba? It's okay. Yeah, protect us. <laughs> and then a water. It's the perfect size water to fit in my bag. So Pesto gets thirsty because he didn't last very long. And then my beats. And sunglasses. But yeah. All the necessities. Ready to go for a hot baby walk. Mm. Riley has a game tonight. I'm gonna hit a home run. <laughs> Do you wanna go for a walk? With your mom? Should we go? You don't want to? Okay, bye. <gasps> That's what I thought. Okay, let's go. Oh, shoot. Let's do it. lasted literally 25 minutes the little mile and a half and I'm gonna go to the gym now and finish up that workout cuz you're a little lazy bum workout did some walking and then a little bit of arm strength training I haven't done that in a while so that was good killed myself a little bit there <gasps> who's this hi Annie oh my goodness um I forgot that I put in a load of laundry earlier today so gotta switch over the laundry because I have some rotting clothes awesome showered and I'm now having dinner. I realize I'm so hungry. So I'm having leftovers, this pasta dish. It does not look appetizing, don't judge. But it's so easy. It was hearts of palm pasta. So you just like from Trader Joe's put it on the stove and like heat it up. And then I baked zucchini, tomatoes, pepper, onion, and arugula and mushrooms. Oh, and then like half a block of feta. Baked it in the oven for 20 minutes, took it out, mushed it all together, added lemon juice and put it over the hearts of palm. And it's literally so good and so flavorful. I'm so happy with it. So finishing leftovers with that. Um, and then I'm probably just going to chill for the rest of the night. Riley's baseball game is over in a little bit. So when he gets back, we're gonna watch Big Brother and just hang out. So. Things are coming along me for this weekend. Not a lot of thrilling things happened, but it was fun. And I go back to work tomorrow after having a long vacation. So gotta get back to it. Uh, thanks, bye.